Financial sparks are set to fly next week with Scotland set to unveil its annual budget but SNP ministers have been accused of not being transparent with their funding. Amid constitutional wrangling over a second independence vote, SNP ministers are finalizing their plans on a plan to recover and renew from the COVID-19 pandemic. The Scottish Finance Secretary, who will present her plan to MSPs on Thursday, has been at loggerheads with her Treasury counterparts over how funds should be controlled as nationalist ministers hold down their position on Scottish independence. But in pre-budget consultations, the Scottish Finance Secretary said sectors have stressed the need for targeted support, which she claims will be delivered. However, Chancellor Rishi Sunak told the SNP-led Scottish Government to acknowledge the support the UK Government was providing during the coronavirus pandemic. Questions have also been raised by the Scottish Conservatives as to whether millions of pounds of Brexit funds had been spent or whether the SNP-led administration was stashing away cash. Maurice Golden MSP, the party's economy spokesperson, claimed the SNP was not lifting a finger overspending. At the same time, Treasury figures revealed Scottish firms had benefited from more than £3.4 billion of UK government-backed loans to protect and support jobs across the country. They reveal 86,000 loans have supported businesses across all sectors, protecting UK jobs. Dividing the total spent by the number of loans reveals an average of £39,534 union boost has been given to Scottish business, the data shows. Alongside this, Tory UK ministers also say they have protected 930,000 jobs through the furlough job retention scheme and provided £8.6 billion in Barnet consequentials to the SNP-led administration in Edinburgh. Speaking today, Mr Sunak said, throughout this crisis, we have provided more than £280 billion of support to protect jobs and livelihoods up and down the country. We are committed to continuing to ensure jobs are protected and opportunity is created, Alistair Jack, Secretary of State for Scotland, added, throughout the pandemic, the UK government has taken quick and unprecedented action to protect jobs and support businesses in Scotland. Today's figures speak for themselves, over 90,000 businesses across Scotland have benefited from £3.4 billion in UK government-backed loans providing a vital lifeline and certainty to plan for the months ahead. As we continue to see throughout this pandemic, the strength of the union and support offered by the UK Treasury has never been more important. Angry business owners also claim they haven't received support from the Scottish Government. One Scottish business owner claimed in a Scottish business group, my business is in its second lockdown and I am qualifying for no money apart from loans.